Tonight we're going to make a yoga exercises for back pain. Since I am reaching the last week of second trimester, I thought it would be perfect to make a yoga exercises for back pain because it's getting heavier my tummy and so the pain in my back is also getting heavier every single day that passed. So here I just sit down squatting and turn your body like this in circle. Close your eyes as you draw a circle using your body like this. You can make faster if you want or not. It's up to you. It depends how you feel. Before that, consult your doctor before you make any exercises. Every mother's is different in every situation of their pregnancy. This one seems to be very easy for me and I thought it fits me well and very doable. So now I'm gonna place my hand like this and to the other side, remain squatting, stretching that side. It's really good as well as good for the back. You can really feel it. You don't have to bend your body too much to the side. And repeating that in the other side as well. So feel that stretch there. It's really good. Remember just not too much. So stay there a little bit longer and switch to the other side once you feel it's time to push to the other side keep going wait there a little bit few seconds and inhale exhale take a few breath for that exercise and then here have your knee on the floor and your arm and make like this a cut and position like this they call it a cat and dog position or just a cat I have to check that again this is very useful exercise for the back pain so as you can see I like to make a yoga exercises with you it keeps me motivated to do it with you to stay our body active during pregnancy because many of us or at least me sometimes I feel very lazy to make any yoga exercises so I thought I would do it with you and also watching another videos to help me keep going with my yoga exercises to help me in my pregnancy when we are pregnant the bed are just so tempting to lay down but then I thought I have to do it and we have to keep moving for our healthiness for our baby and for us preparing for the delivery so keep going like that and once you're done go down squat your legs but open to have a space for your belly and then I just swing a little bit not too much so just a little bit and then I stop swinging and only if you feel safe for that position to swing your body when you are in this position and go down this is good for the back to relax have your head down feel the stretch at your back and go up put your head up wait there a few seconds and go down again once you're ready or satisfied I did not make any counting or how many seconds it should be I just feel like when I'm ready to switch I go for the next and a few seconds right there and go up I only listen to my body when it's ready to for the next position and head down and here as you can see I make a little bit curve in my back this is also really nice and switch to the next position 
of your legs at the front stretch that one and bend your back again this is a nice stretch for the legs as well as nice bend stretch for the back i can feel it and it's really satisfying make sure this uh, yoga exercises is best for you consult your doctor before doing so like i said every mothers have different uh, situations during our pregnancies so i stayed a little bit longer and go up bend at the back a little bit to take that back again or to stretch that back in the front lay down stay like this have your arm on the ground go up and stretch that back and the front again feels like you're lay, uh, leaning down and like this so I'll repeat it a few times like that close your eyes and feel the body of your movements and see if your body likes the position or the exercises stretches for your back pain stay there a little bit and repeat and, but this time i have my leg a little bit up or my knee and go down stretch your back again we focus at the back pain here yoga exercises for the back pain The baby are just getting heavier or just giving heavier every single day as our belly are growing or as we reach the delivery date. So spread your legs like this and bend your back having your both arms in the front. Stay there as long as you want at least for me I stay there as long as I want when I feel like I have enough of that um, stretches so I go up and repeat again so there is no pressure with the time when it should stop only listen to your body I'm not an expert for this but that's what I am doing right for my pregnancy exercises for the back pain and have your legs wide open to stretch that and opening the pelvic floor and have that stretch like this so I saw these exercises, a yoga exercises all over internet and I thought it would be nice to try it as well I never been so active in yoga lately but I thought it's time to change our hobby when we are pregnant most especially so let's get motivated together mothers to keep us healthy while reaching our delivery time have your legs like this put your foot together and hold it with your arms and bend your body down wait there a few seconds and once you're ready switch to the next yoga exercise like this holding my knee like that on my feet like this and switching my body side by side this is actually really nice switching my body like this as I sit like this position it's really nice stretching at the back as well I really like it and I did it a few times
like that. And repeating again. Head up, stretch a little bit at the back while you're holding the weight in the front. And repeat again. Super simple and easy back pain yoga exercises. Very doable, but make sure to check with your doctor if this is applicable for your situations. And like this, I open it a little bit to have or to feel that stretch in my back or in my legs. Sorry, my legs. And then knee on the floor and the arm in the front and in the arm, other arm on the back. Close your eyes, feel the stretch. Stay there a few times when you're ready and switch to the other side. Super easy. I really like this yoga exercise as well. So I stay there a little bit and have a cut position like this and switch to the other side again. I only repeated this once and I stay there a little bit longer. Feel the stretch at your back and in your arm and have your head relax on the ground. Once you're ready, switch to the next position. Inhale, exhale from the previous position of yoga exercise. It's really good to relax every now and then and not you're rushing down while you're doing your yoga. And then here, lay down. Have your tool close to your um, arm and go up and down. Repeat that a few times. Up and down. This is actually good for the back as well. I really like all the chooses or chosen back pain exercises yoga that I have picked for the for this yoga exercises. So as you can see, I only pick which positions that best suits for me when I search online and I apply that one and check if it's uh, doable for me or not. If it's not doable for me, I don't take it. And if it is doable, I take it. So it's always depends to you what you prefer or what's best and not painful for your body. I have here a pillow, a yoga pillow and have my arm there and just bend the body like this. In this sitting position, open your knees for the space of your tummy. We need more space for the tummy because tummy is reaching the last second semester of the week. Or last week of the second semester, I mean. And pose in that position. It's actually really relaxing, this one and just feel like I'm sleepy. So this is my last one and I relax and lay down like this to relax the body from this back exercise or back pain yoga exercises for prenatals. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys get motivated with me as you motivated me as I make these yoga exercises for the back pain for pregnant mothers. I think this is also best for not only pregnant mothers but also for everyone. But for pregnant mothers, this is the best that I chose and it's really satisfying 
and that's it see you in my next yoga exercises bye